be teaching you on how to make a mug, whilst I'm going to be teaching you on how to make a broom and a pack. So first you take a square and then you fold it let small. So take your time if you want to do it right. So first you take a box. Make sure you make the box smooth. You will make a square, a square shape. Then you fold it into a triangle. Fold it into a triangle. The way you open it, line will be in the middle. Then you fold it again. Then after you have done that, you open it. Then you see that you have, you have four. One, two, three, four, four lines. Actually, there are, there are two that it's making for. Then you bring this edge here to the middle. Then you continue bringing the edges to the middle like this. You bring another one to the middle and make it smooth. Bring the other one to the middle and make it smooth and bring the last one to the middle. And after I've done that, it will look like this. Then you take this side or any other side here, then you put it in the middle. Then take the top side too and put it too in the middle. Then it will be like this. Then when you open it, you see like they do the same thing to this side too. So now you take your rectangle and you fold it. Then glue the end. So now I've opened it and I'm done. Then you can just remove two of this. Then you just bring this side to the middle. Then bring the other side to the middle. Please watch attentively. It will be like this. First, when you are finished folding all the lines, doing all the lines, you open it and you, to, you fold this out to the middle and this out to the middle and make it straight. Then, you, this is the... So now I have folded the rectangle. So now you are going to be cutting from this side, not this side. So you are going to cut it like this. So now, after I've done that, this is a tricky part. You make this place come here like this. Let me show you. You you do like this, then you bend it like this. Then you bring it inside here. So like this, you bring this side here, then you bring this one inside it. So now what then? So now it's going to take your handle. That's why the, the decoration can also add something to it. So now you take your handle and you put it at the end and glue it together. Watch yeah. how I'm doing. Then do the same thing to the other side like this. Do the same thing to the other side. Then you have this shape. Then you just crisscross this one here like this and you bring this edge to like this. Actually, I'm making this packer here, over here. This is what I'm making. Then I'll make the broom. Yeah. <laughs> you can decide to glue it if you want so it to stay straight. Now you just take another piece of paper, then you just roll it. You can start by rolling it in a triangle shape and then from year to year, like I'm doing, or you can just do from year to year. Make sure the paper is long. This will be the handle over here. So I'm going to add a little decoration to it. So now you just put glue to it here so it will stick together. Then you make here flat. This is where you put the glue for the handle. Then you just put some glue small one here then you stick it to the back of the pack so i'm making the handle so as i said you can put glue inside here so it will make it strong and straight and stick together
you can use paper glue or super glue as i decided to use super glue because it's very fast and dry so now i've done that packer oh, see the packet now i'm going to be doing the broom fast fast so now you take your scissors you cut cut the paper like this and as i said you just roll it as i said you can roll the paper from the triangle side to here or this side so i'm is it triangle okay. Then now, then you glue it so it will stick together. Okay, I'm done. So now I'm going to be doing this plate that you use to sweep in the room. First, you take a rectangle shape like this. Then you fold it like this. Then, then you fold, fold it, it like this. Oh, okay. Oh. So, so these are some of the things you can use cardboard to make. So you, these are some of the many more things as we say you can use it for drawing and making so many things. Nice. So after I have folded it, you take your scissors and make sure you cut like this. So like this, it will be like this. Then you cut from year to year. You cut it around shape. So you cut it like this. Then it will be like this. They will just cut some slides there for the broom. So, please, I will beg you to subscribe to our channel. Keep on subscribing. And if you want us to do anything, you can go to the description box where you find our guardians email. And you can also ask us some questions what you want us to do so that we can do it. And you see, and if you want any anything that you want us to do on this channel you can tell us to do it so now i'm done cutting it then it'll be like this then you just glue it to here so now i'll just take my glue make this side flat for the glue then i'll put this edge over here <laughs> so now i'm done we well, are done the genius and Ben Tankin. God bless you. Goodbye. Bye. You can even add you can even add some googly eyes to it or eyes and flavor. So yeah, some rubbish. I'm going to be sweeping. And I'll move the ball. And remember, if you found any difficulties when you're doing this, remember to try, try again, as I always say. And remember to always involve God in whatever you do. Because, because what God cannot do does not exist. So, Genius in Bentucket. God bless you. Goodbye. Dun, 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 dun.